Welcome back. In this video tutorial, we are going to see how to import shapefile in Google Earth Engine. So let us take a view of this shapefile. So this is what we are going to upload in Google Earth Engine. So let us move on to the Google Earth Engine. And here you can see, if you navigate, you can find assets. So click on assets. So in order to upload the shapefile, click on new. And you could see here, upload, image upload, table upload. Here choose shapefile. Click on it. Now you could see the source file. So click on select. So this is the shapefile. Different extensions are there. The same shapefile which I have shown you in ArcMap. Now let us select the files one by one. You can see the allowed extensions SHP, DBF, PRJ, SSX, CPG, FIX, QIX and SBN or SHP dot KML. So please carefully watch here. I'm going to select this file CPG, DBF, PRJ, SBN, SHP, HSX. So I'm going to leave back SBX. Okay. Now click on open. Now you could see here it has been successfully taken in. If there is any problem, it will be highlighted in red color. So the uploaded shape file name is Africa. So next come down and you can see the option upload. Click on upload. So the uploader has been started. You can check it in the task section and you can see here it is showing me in less than a minute the shape file will be uploaded. So let us wait for it. You can see a small tick mark will be appearing over here and within one minute it has been completed. So now let us head back to the asset section and let us refresh it. So now you can see the shape file has been uploaded successfully. You can visualize it by clicking on top of it. So you can view the asset like this, features and its properties. So now let me close it and let us see how to add the file. So you can see that shape file. Uh, we just need to import it to the script. After pressing this button, you can see here it has been imported to this script. So now we are going to use the codes for visualizing it. So type in map map dot. So type in map dot add layer. And you can see the bracket over here. So here we are going to input this shape file. So you can find where table. This is nothing but the shape file. So if you want, you can change the name to Africa and it, it will be reflected here as well. We just need to change it to Africa. Now after doing it, click on run. Now let us zoom in and you can now visualize this. We have successfully imported the shape file into Google Earth Engine. So here before it was table, it is just a default name given to this shape file Africa. So I have changed the name here and after that I have updated here. It will be reflected. So thanks for watching. If you have had any other doubts on this, please do ask in the comment section. Thank you everyone. Please do subscribe the channel. Goodbye.